Welcome to the Laravel Collections Guide. In this series, we take a look at each of the available methods in the Laravel Collection class and dive deep through examples in explaining what it does. Today, we're going to be looking at reverse. Reverse is a simple method that reverses a collection. As always, let's start with our basic example. Let's collect a new array and we'll just have four digits in it and then we call the reverse method on it. Let's check out the results. So there we are. We passed in 1, 2, 3, and 4, and we got back 4, 3, 2, and 1. Now, I do want you to notice something here, and that is that our keys remain the same. This is a zero-based array, which means that 1 has an index of 0, 2 has an index of 1, 3 has an index of 2, and 4 has an index of 3. When we reverse the collection, those indexes actually remain the same. So we have 3, 2, 1, and 0. So that's the first thing to note about reverse. Reverse maintains the keys of the original array. That's an important thing to know about reverse. To drive the point home even more, I'm going to change this example a little bit. Let's do key 1 and set that equal to string 1. And let's repeat that a couple of times. Let's change this to string 2 and this one to string 3. Let's check out the results. So here we are. I think it's a little easier to see now. So string three is still attached to key three. We are reversing both values and keys. As you can tell, this whole thing is reversed. Now, sometimes this is appropriate, but sometimes you do not want to maintain the keys, in which case you can actually append another method call. That method call would actually be values. Values will reset all of the keys in this collection. And so we're back to 0, 1, 2, so our zero based index, but our values are still reversed. So we're still at 3, 2, 1 with no indexes. If we revisited our very first example where we had 1, 2, 3, and 4, there we are. We still have 4, 3, 2, 1. However, our index continues to be 0, 1, 2, and 3. I'm going to remove values just to show you the difference. And there we are, 3, 2, 1, and 0. So keep that in mind whenever you're in need of using the reverse method.